Good day, good day. How the hunk are ya? Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dan. Hey, guess what we're gonna look at today? Bruder. Yeah, we're gonna look at Bruders today. Uh, multifunctional. Go check them out. www. Bruder. I don't know what DE means, but yeah, check them out. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen. Made in the EU, Germany. Yes, if you don't know about these guys, then uh, you haven't been in the toy aisle. These are kind of popular, kind of, uh, yeah. Uh, they are a high-end toy. They are a high-end toy, that's for sure. And I got two of them, so we're going to take a look at them. Um, I do not uh, feel comfortable enough yet to take one out of the box. I'd like to get one more. Here you go, 1 16th scale. Uh, they also offer a Defender pickup, which got one of those. We'll see a little bit more about the interior there. Let's just take a look around the box. Here is uh, just like the real thing, the station wagon. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Nice depictions of the picture. Got some suspension opening features. All right. Bruder, as far as I know, is uh, they make a lot of implement, uh, farm implement. Yeah, the, uh, what do they call that? Unitarianism. And, and, and look at that. That's in German. Berkestik and Mordeganugan Dagen Esnegen Flurden. That's my, uh, my imitation of German, just so you know. <laughs> All right. Um, I believe I bought these pair, one right after another, out of a, oh, like a tool catalog type thing. It wasn't a toy um, catalog. It was... Uh, yeah, tool catalog back uh, several, several years ago. And um, yeah, so they, I, I bought them. Uh, they usually range, uh, and a lot of times these come a uh, bigger package with the trailer with some kind of uh, something with them. Uh, a lot of times uh, with the police livery. But mainly they're all plastic um, construction, and uh, but pretty hardy. It does have an opening hood. I think we can get that open, yeah. So pretty pretty neat interior. Uh, look at the engine there if we can. Not bad, not bad. Try to get in there and take a look. Pretty neat, pretty neat. And it does have opening doors. Now these are uh, still in the package, so they still have the safety tape over them. Uh, rubber wheels. Uh, realistic rims on them, step guards to them. I really like this uh, green. These are left-hand hookers. Left hookers, very nice. I believe the back door does open. Yep, there we, we can open it up a little bit. But uh, very nice. This one comes with a roof rack on it. Very unique. Now, I believe that this sun uh, sunroof comes open because on the bottom of these comes a little stick steering wheel that you can put in through here which is really great for uh, playability you put it in through here and you put it in that uh, keyhole and you can steer the truck around you just go and so you can burr, 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 you know and uh, steer it around so it has Movable working steering wheel as well as that suspension. Can you see kind of how that suspension works there? Just kind of really kind of neat. These are really kind of neat. But uh, like today, if you wanted to find one of these around here in Wisconsin uh, off a retail shelf, Farm and Fleet, Fleet Farm, those kind of uh, horse and tractor, uh, horse and goat, uh, you know kind of stores like that and like I say sometimes they, they you know obviously they sell tractors and other things too but they'll slip these Bruder Land Rovers in there 
and they call for like 60, 80 bucks. So these are kind of spendy. They're quality. They're made in Germany. Yeah, so they're quality right there. But see there, they're recommended for three years and up. So, oh yeah, here we go. This is, uh, this kind of shows you how the key works there. We can get in focus there. See the key just is, uh, it's uh, highlighted there in the, in the orange. That's not the shape of the key, but that's the highlight. And you can see that it sticks right in there and you can turn the wheels. So really kind of cool. Yeah, see, and you can pop out that sunroof and really go to town. All right, so that's the green one that I've got. Let's take a look at the white one. This one, uh, I did uh, get a discount on this one because uh, when it came, the mirror was broke off it. And I'm like, hey, uh, dudes, you sent me a broke toy. And uh, so they, sent, they did give me a discount there. There you can see that keyhole right there. So, uh, you know, you can uh, put your steering wheel extension in there. But very nice details, very, very cool. Hold on one second. Let me uh, just grab my flashlight here and see if we can uh, shine in there and get a little bit better look here of uh, what we're looking at here. Yeah, see there? Now this is kind of dusty. They, it doesn't come with the dust shield on there. It is meant as a toy, so they don't put any uh, cellophane uh, shadow box dusting dust in there but look at the details in that dash very nice very nice and then the steering wheel does work as well that will move the steering and then there's that uh peg uh keyhole for the extended uh yeah workings but very very cool very cool there's more pinholes or attachments and you can see how the uh, hard top goes on top of there. So uh, on the hard top, I believe they take this roll cage off and then they put uh, the um, hard top on it. So very, very cool model. This is a uh, cream white. Let's take a look and see if we can get under the hood here once. And uh, yeah, there we go. Let's get that flashlight again and see if we can really get a nice detail in there for that. I really like this. I I keep my eye open at, uh, you know, toy swap meets and, uh, and things like that. I'd really like to get one of these out of the package so I can really play around with it and uh, do some stuff with it. But just a very, very neat model. I really like these. But like I say, these are a high-end toy. And... Uh, but very, very playable. You know, the doors open on them. It's got a snorkel. Check that out. It's got a snorkel on it. And, uh, yeah, like this, the steering wheel. I don't know if we can get that to move enough in the packaging. But just, just totally neat. Totally neat. <clears throat> Excuse me. Has a uh, tow hitch in the back there. And I already put this flashlight away. Way to go. But uh, just totally, totally neat. I really like these. These sit together. The brothers sit together there. Let's take a look at the bottom of this one, see if it's any different than the other one. No, it looks about like the same, same packaging. And uh, so there we go. Do you have one of these? Do you got? Do you have brooders where you are? Do you uh, do you have a collection of these? How many do you have? They are pretty, pretty cool. I like them. Like I said, they're not very prevalent in the U.S. per se, uh, especially here in Wisconsin. Just a couple of retailers uh, around do uh, carry the Bruder brand, but a lot of times it's, uh, you know, the tractors and things like that. Look at that. They got the combine. So, uh, and, and the ones that I have seen, the last time I saw one of these in the store, I believe it was uh, Farm and Fleet, which is a local, uh, you know, retailer from uh, clothes to can bulk candies to uh, tires and implements and horse supply things. So kind of the hobbyist farm store. But the last time they do uh, Christmas Toyland, and last time I saw one of these that had a trailer, I believe it was a police edition. And uh, yeah, it was like 80 some dollars uh, brand new. 
I almost bought one. It was after Christmas, and they were marking it down, and there was one there uh, in Lacrosse, and I almost bought it. It was down to like 40 some bucks, but at the time, that was still a lot of money for me to fork over at the time. You know, Christmas had just happened, <laughs> so, so we were still low on funds. So there you go. Yeah, let me know in the comments below. Do you have these in, uh, across the pond? Are they pretty prevalent? Are they, are they a little bit cheaper over there, or are they still stand up for a pretty quality uh, price there? Which is, it's not bad, but it's just a little bit more than what I would want to spend for, you know, getting several of these. So, there we go. That's our truck of the Land Rover of the video today on Roverland. Thank you very much for sticking with me. If you like what you see here, make sure you hit that like button. Go ahead, give me a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe so we can keep on going and doing more videos of Land Rovers here on the channel. And as always, share and subscribe and tell your friends, hey, you can go on Facebook. We're on Facebook with Roverland. We're on Instagram and at the uh, Roverland channel on Instagram. So check it out. There we go, folks. We're going to call it a video. Thank you for sticking around with your friend Dano. Remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rover day.